Our first act has six legs, which means it really should be called Sex Pod. But they've climbed out of their Sex Pod to be with us. Please welcome Tripod. Thank you. That was told one time to me by people who had had it told to them <laughs> by their forefathers and their foremothers. <laughs> it was a little late person traveling troop of storytelling parents, but that's not the focus of the tale. Sorry. What's important is the story of a stranger who came riding on his horse <laughs> on the dusty trail. Oh. <laughs> He's embellishing by saying that it was a dusty trail, but I think it's pretty safe to assume that the road building methods of the time would have been quite crude. <laughs> To say the least. <laughs> Actually, strictly speaking, to say the least would be to do this. <laughs> but you get the idea. No one knew where he came from. No one knew who he was. Presumably his parents and a few childhood chums <laughs> Knew him A great black steed and spirit was his name The horse's name, not the bloke <laughs> The finest gambler in the county He broke all the ladies' hearts I'm still talking about the horse <laughs> The man rode round performing acts That may have broke the law Or angered someone in some other way so subsequently he was inevitably caught up with by some state or county appointed figure of authority or local strongman. <laughs> I can't make my boobs move. Damn, damn. Damn. <laughs> One fateful day. All night. Brought before a judge or jury. He may have been put to death. In some exciting way Or oh, boring way <laughs> Like a legal loophole <laughs> There he goes ah! Riding into the sun He dissolves into a vapour As he nears the burning oil Maybe it's just a metaphor. <laughs> well, obviously, it doesn't get actually that close to the sun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This, this is the Earth, right? Yeah. He's on a horse. <laughs> you, know, you know, the sun's actually quite far away from him. Like, the horse yeah, is probably. He's stuck. got the horse springs on his cowboy boots. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
you guys get your stories straight? Because he reckons there's a horse that can fight in the sun. Different ways what if it, it was like an elastic band between two trees? Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's the sun. Oh, pull me back. Yeah. All right, boys, ready? Go! <laughs> He would starve. He would starve. If the sun is so far away, he would starve before he got to the sun. No, he just goes so fast that before he starved. No, he would. You don't know anything about physics, right? Nothing. You could bring a snack. I don't understand physics. You could take a snack with him. Yes, definitely a metaphor.